Hello guys, this is Del from Elixir Node and today we're gonna do top 20 most useful CSGO Archon commands. Stay tuned and let's get right into the video. Okay guys, so on the first place we got the Archon password command. This is the most important command out of this list and for any server owner. Because without it, you won't be able to do any Archon commands. First of all, let me show you how you can set up your Archon password and set it as you wish. First, go into your server dashboard and select your CSGO server, go to file management, then go to CSGO and open the CFG folder. Press the new file button, name it server.cfg and all you have to type is archon underscore password, then put some commas and between the commas type your password. In this video, I'll just use Elixir node, then press create file. And now let's type it in CSGO. Okay guys, so all that's left to do is type archon underscore password and type in the password. As you can see, everything should now work properly. On second place, we got the archon status command. And with this command, as you can see, you will get a lot of information. You will get the OS, the IP of the server, the version, and the map and a lot of things that are really helpful. The third place is taken by Archon Map. With this command you can easily change the map of the server. Now in my case let's change it to Mirage. All you have to do is type Archon Map Mirage and press enter. Now it will instantly change the map because of the fast servers from Elixir node that don't forget they are cheap and you get premium quality. If you want to get your own server, just go to elixirnode.com and don't forget to join our Discord, help, Discord server for some help from the stuff. Now, as you can see, the map has been changed and everything is working. Let's go straight to the fourth place. Okay, guys, on the next place, we got Archon users. This command will show you information about the players on your server, their slot and their names. If you type Archon users, as you can see, it shows that there is one user online. And that is me, it shows my slot and my name. Pretty easy to use and really helpful. Okay guys, on the fifth place we got the archon kick command. All you have to do is type archon kick and then put the player's name. And as you can see, my friend just got kicked. On the sixth place we got another important command that is really useful for admins. And that is archon, sorry, ban id. And after that, if you enter it, you will see what you have to put the arguments. You will have to put the minutes. If you want to permanently ban a player from your server, just put zero and then the user ID and then the reason. Let's go like the reason should be a hacker. And now all that's left to do is press enter and the player will be permanently banned from our server with the reason that he is a hacker. On the 7th place we got the archon say command and with this command you will just display a message in the console that will be sent by the console. All you have to do is archon say and then the message let's go hello and as you can see the message appears in the chat. On the 8th place we got another easy command and that is archon host underscore workshop underscore map. And with this command, you'll just have to type the file ID that you will get from a workshop map that you want to set on your server. It's pretty useful and pretty easy to use. On number 9, we got a command that is used by every server owner because it's really helpful and it will save you a lot of time. And that command is archon mp underscore restart game. And let's go for 2 seconds. This command will reload all the configs from your server without, without having to go into the game panel and restarting the entire server. Don't forget about it, it can save you a lot of time and players. Do you want to make your server private or do you want to host a private competitive game? Then the command on the tape place will save you. And that is archon server underscore password and let's say 123. And as you can see, the password has been changed. On number 11, we got archon hostname. And with this command, you can change the name of your server. Let's go with elixir node csgo server. Press enter. 
and if we go to community server and re refresh as you can see the server has changed its name on the 12th place we got a command that will let you execute different configs on your server let's say you want to execute a 1v1 config then you just type archon exec and then let's do 1v1 for example and that will execute that specific config on number 13 we got a command that will let you set the amount of bots in its team and that is archon bot underscore quota and then type the number let's go with two but as i don't have any bots in my game right now i won't set any teams to be equal on number 14 we got a roll command and that is archon cs underscore make underscore vip and all you have to do now is type the player's name and with this command you will make that specific player a VIP on your CSGO hosting. On number 15th we have a command that will literally allow you to change everything on your server and that is from like the freest time from each round to the rounds you can play the teams and everything and that is archon server underscore cheats and make it one. If it's one then you will be able to change everything on your server then if it's zero you won't be able to do that much things as an admin. On the 16th place we got Archon stats and with this command you will be able to review a lot of things. Let's see. You can review your CPU, your maps, your uptime, FPSs, players and the list goes on. If you want to unban some players from your server then the command from the 17th place will help you. And that is Archon list IV. In my case it's empty, but if I had some players banned on the server, it would have shown their name and their ID, and with that ID you could have easily unbanned them. On number 18, we got a command that will let you check all loaded converts and their values from your CSGO hosting server. To do that, you just have to open the console and type archon CVAR list. And as you can see, a lot of values have been shown, and you can also see their name. Okay guys, so on the 19th place we got the Archon Explode command. It's a pretty fun command and you can show your friends who, who is the boss and just have some fun with them. All you have to do is type Archon, Explode, and then your friend's name. And as you can see, he died instantly. On the last place, we got a command that will be your friend all of the time. And that is Archon, Find, and here you'll just have to put a tag. A word that is related to a command. For example, if I do archon find archon, it will show me some commands that are related to the archon word. It's pretty useful and it can help you a lot and do things a lot faster than going and googling the words. Okay guys, so this is the video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you have any questions, don't forget to join our Discord or just write a comment. Don't forget to like the video. And as always, if you want a premium quality hosting with some budget prices, go to alexirnode.com and I'll promise that you'll find the best game hosting at the moment. See you guys till the next video.